Hey, many fish. 9th of December, 2017. Shabbat Shalom. I hope you are blessed today. Um, boy. Father sharing some really, really cool stuff this morning, guys. This hour, this ad right here, right? California are avocados hit with triple whammy fire, wind, and ash. And, and I'm just drawn right away to the avocados. And I think it's partially because I did a video or two back earlier in the year. And one of them was about this ad that I'm sure most of you remember. The avocado from Mexico Super Bowl ad. Where Lucifer is just like laughing his head off. Mocking the dead sheep. The giant obelisk right at the beginning. So on and so forth. But I just wanted to show you a couple little things out of this right now. If we could just... To show at the 23 second mark here where he goes and he turns off the sound there 23 and 23 the 46 the chromosomes right so i have to go to 46 and i gotta listen to what goes on there i okay. just have to agree to disagree what about area 51 what about area 51 she says right at 46 hmm what do most people think about when they think about Area 51? They think about aliens, another race of beings. Isn't that what they think of? Well, isn't that what we're seeing everywhere? I mean, between yesterday's, uh, you know, them wanting to make an ex-gender. That's what it's all about, folks. This is Lucifer literally saying we are becoming one race of beings. And if you succumb to that, then you are turning yourself over to that dark spirit. And I hope this makes sense. Now, again, she says Area 51, and I'm led to go to Psalm 51. I'm just led to go there. If I can find it here. This is just crazy stuff. Psalm 51 is where Nathan the prophet comes on to David after he had gone into Bathsheba. Bathsheba was what? She was a snare to David. His lust literally made him a murderer of her husband. It's just so he could have her, the lust of the flesh. Just like all of us in this world are tempted by all of it. The money, the sex, the everything. You know, we do it to escape this world. You know, you need to repent. In other words, just turn from this temptation and lust of the world that's all that means you know i mean how's that 51 gonna lead to that the snare the snare of the lust the money the all of it you know and it goes on here and i'll show you how this really s wrapped it up for me is the uh the article also says a trippy triple whammy of fire wind and ash so i do like a bible search of of those particular words all together in a uh it's going to be a psalm study day because check this out psalm 11 6 9 11 upside down and i didn't search for this 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 is what it gives me upon the wicked he shall rain snares just like david fell in the snare was caught up by the snare fire and brimstone and an horrible tempest wind this shall be the portion of their cup what are we seeing i mean what are we seeing the signs are everywhere folks everywhere he's making his claim he's making his claim i'm telling you the two have become one that's what you're seeing the x chromosome it's all in front of us and all you need to do is seek jesus if you don't know him to understand a lick of what i'm talking about and every bit of what you need to know is in this book the holy bible get sword so i had to of course share that with you guys and it goes on it comes back to this article about hand injuries and avocados and pierced hands uh-huh that's right pierced hands 
Psalm again. Psalm 22, 16, For the dogs have compassed me. The assembly of the wicked have enclosed me. They pierced my hands and my feet. You see what I'm saying now? It's on us, folks. I mean, I'm not kidding. I say this, and I'm going to continue saying it because it's true. You need to seek Jesus, and you need to do it now. For all my brothers and sisters, Shabbat Shalom to you. Peace and grace. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, 